I'm Steve Moore with Emerson, and I'm here today to talk to you about the Emerson Smart Wireless Thumb Adapter. And what the wireless thumb adapter does is it allows you to unleash many of the diagnostics and the process variables that are available in your existing heart devices in your plants today. Now in the past, you had access to those diagnostics and additional variables only if you had perhaps a Delta V or an Ovation control system. But through the use of the thumb adapter, we now unleash all of these uh, variables to you today. Now, what does that mean for you? What it means for you is you're going to either have a more reliable plant, you're going to have a more secure plant, or you're going to have a more cost-effective plant for you to run. Today we're going to talk about three specific applications. We're going to talk about how you can measure tank levels, get more variables out of those tank levels using the thumb adapter. We're going to talk about meter verification with the Micromotion Coriolis meter. And then we're going to talk about how you can have a more reliable valve with better operation and control using the thumb adapter with your Fisher valves. The first is radar. In this particular case, we're looking at a Rex, one of our top of the line products. And with this particular product, by having the thumb adapter, two things can happen. One, if it's an existing radar that you have out in the field, those additional variables that maybe have been hidden in the past, such as rate of change, or be able to get a level as well as a volume in your tank, you now have those all those available. If you don't have a measurement on your tank today, the thumb adapter allows us to go back and actually eliminate that wiring. You've got power to be able to power the device on top of your tank. Now we can bring all those variables back in, along with any other information that might be there. Second thing that we can do is how many of you are using a Coriolis meter as the cash register for your plant? The meter verification within the Coriolis meter allows you to inline, without pulling it out of the process, be able to verify the accuracy and the reliability of this particular product. Not just the transmitter, but also the meter itself. Through the use of meter verification, what we are able to do is wirelessly send a signal to the transmitter. The transmitter, while it's still in operation, then runs through a process of validating and checking itself and the tube. And then after that, it's able to come back and give us a certificate that basically says everything is fine. We passed or we failed. In the past, you've had to pull the meter out of line. That was costly not only from the standpoint of running the test, but also your process had to be down. Your process can still be in action while you run this meter verification. The, th the third thing that I want to show you is how many of you have, in the past, had an issue with a control valve and not realized it until the process is completely upset? In this case, what we did was we pulled the air off the valve and released the signal. From the display, you can see that even in your legacy system, it no longer has to be Ovation or Delta V, that we're able to pick up through OPC in this particular application the fact that we have an issue with the valve. So using AMS, your technician would be able to diagnose the problem wirelessly before he ever goes to the valve. In this particular case, he would realize that there's a loss of air supply and he would go to the valve prepared for the repair. In this case, we'll just plug it back in. Wirelessly also, we'll recognize that the alert is cleared as soon as it is cleared. I'd like to thank you very much for listening to this presentation on the thumb. And for additional information, if you just visit the URL listed right here, you'll be able to find much more information. Thank you.